Hello guys, I hope you are doing really really well. Today I have with me Microsoft Surface Slim Pen 2 and in this video I am going to do the latency and handwriting test for this pen. The tablet that I am using is Microsoft Surface Pro 9. So let's start. The first app that I am going to use is Microsoft OneNote. It is a pre-installed app and I will make it on the full screen. So guys, this Slim Pen 2 has 4096 levels of pressure sensitivity. Okay, and uh, the tip of uh, this S Pen is made out of hard plastic. Okay, so you can see over here when I am writing, the ink is following the pen tip. Okay, so you can see over here. So if I am writing here, so you can see this is how it looks like. Okay, and now for example, I try to write fast. Okay, so here you can see. So it is going pretty smooth now i will try to draw lines okay so this is how it looks like you can see over here okay so the line is following uh, the pen tip there is no gap okay and if i try to make this line a little faster okay so this is how it looks like so you can see over here guys i will also use the highlighter i will show you uh, with the highlighter so this is how it looks like with the highlighter okay so you can see over here so there is a vibrator inside the pen so when you uh, write it so you will feel a kind of vibration in your fingers okay and you can also change its intensity as well okay so here is the second highlighter with a different color so you can see it is following the pen tip so you can see over here the next thing that i am going to talk about is palm rejection so guys palm rejection is working perfectly fine on this tablet so you can see i put my hand over here i rest my palm okay while i am writing okay and you can see there are no spots over here okay so the palm rejection working perfectly fine the next app that i'm going to try is clip studio okay so it's a drawing app okay i use this uh, brush tool okay and i use uh, this round mixing brush and now i try to draw lines okay so you can see over here there is a little gap when i try to make it a little faster okay so you can see over here between the pen tip and the ink okay so i will do it with another this uh, gauche okay and then i will try to draw so here you can see there is a little gap between the pen tip and the line but it's acceptable uh, let's move to the dry one so this is the dry okay and then uh, i will use this pointillism okay so this is how it looks like now i will use the watercolor and wet wash okay so this is how it looks like in the wet wash now i will use the round watercolor brush okay so this is how it looks like if i try to draw okay so here you can see okay uh, now let's move to this india ink and brush pen okay so you will have more clear idea okay so here is some gap you can see between the pen tip and uh, this line okay and if i try to use this wet blotting ink so this is the wet blotting ink so this is working perfectly fine okay now i will uh, use this pencil tool okay and in the pencil we have this pastel okay so we have this charcoal so i will use this charcoal okay so this is how it looks like so you can see okay and then I, I will use this chalk okay so this is how it looks like in the chalk okay and then uh, let's move to the pencil uh, mechanical pencil so this is how it looks like in the mechanical pencil there is a little gap between the uh, line and the pen tip okay now let's move to the pen tool okay so i will uh, use this pen tool writing here so you can see it is working perfectly fine even if i try to write fast okay and then we have a different option in the pens okay so let's say i will use this calligraphy pen okay 
so I will use this calligraphy so you can see the next app that I'm going to use is Microsoft whiteboard so I will open this app okay so here you can see so first of all I will use this normal pen okay uh, with the full thickness okay and then I will select this galaxy color okay now I try to write okay so you can see it is writing fine okay so you can see the uh, ink is following the pen tip okay and then if I try to uh, draw a line okay then you will see okay so here you can see so it is also working perfectly fine the next thing that I want to mention here is about pressure sensitivity uh, if I just uh, uh, use the normal pressure so you can see here the lines okay so this is how it looks like but if i put more pressure okay so here i put more pressure you can see there is a huge difference so the pressure sensitivity is working perfectly fine as well you can also change the pressure sensitivity by yourself i will show you uh, later the next app that i'm going to try is bamboo paper okay so i will uh, just uh, write here with my slim pen tool okay so it is also working perfectly fine if I try to write fast so you can see it also working perfectly fine okay and then for example if I try to uh, draw a line okay so here you can see there is very little gap so overall it is working perfectly fine if I try to uh, make like a fast uh, if I try to put these lines in fast move so here you can see okay you can also see uh, this video in the slow speed so you will have more exact idea okay so you can see The next thing that I want to mention here is how you can change the pressure sensitivity of this pen. Okay, so first of all, I just go to the start menu and then uh, scroll down from here and you will see this option of surface. Just select it. Once you select it here, you can see at the bottom you have another option of surface slim pen 2. Just select it. Once you select it here, you can see this option of pen pressure just select and then here you can test the pen pressure sensitivity so if uh, I will just erase it okay and then you can see there is a bar over here you can make it light or heavy for example I make it heavy and then I try to write okay so here you can see this is how it, how it looks like okay and then if you want you can also uh, reduce the pressure sensitivity for example I will make it light okay and then I try to write okay so this is how it looks like so you can test the pressure sensitivity over here you can select this pencil or pen so this is the pencil and then you can see this is how it looks like with the pencil okay and then if you want you can also check the graph just select this advanced option and here we have uh, this graph option so when you change the sensitivity the graph will also change and it will show you how does it look like exactly okay so it is showing you the output stroke thickness and input pen pressure okay so here you can see so you can test uh, this pressure sensitivity over here so guys at the overall slim pen 2 latency and handwriting experience is fantastic and please like this video okay and please subscribe to my channel thank you very much